What's up, you cornhole and cocksuckers? I'm McStud. And I'm Mrs. McStud. Have you ever been a cornhole and cocksucker? No. You know what that is? No. You cornhole someone, it's like fuck them in the ass, and then they suck their cock when you're done. That's fucked up. That is fucked up. That's nasty. That is. That's. I believe they call it ass to mouth. Ew. Are you an that's ass? That's a thing. Yes. Are you ass an ass to mouth fan? Uh uh. Yeah, that's pretty Nothing fucking. Nothing with the ass. We don't eat ass. No. Nothing either. like that. That's just gross. Anyways, motherfuckers, it's Fucky Ducky Friday, according to our good buddy. However, but we all really know it's Michael Bolton Friday, mm -hmm. right? No thumbs down. I'm going to be playing music, and it's not going to be Michael Bolton. You better be fucking Michael I Bolton. I'm in R&B mood. Uh-huh. Be like... Oh, that's cool. I can roll with that. Sway your body. Oh, yeah, we got that baby making music. And he be interrupting my motherfucking jams on the way home today, because I ain't used to him being awake. He wanted a fucking call. Fucking jamming out to some boys to men. Shit. Fuck. I'm sorry. Yeah, I didn't... Motherfuck. I couldn't sleep well today, so I ended up getting up, and I cleaned. I done all the running. I got the prescriptions. Um, yeah. Yeah, I, I did. Uh-oh, you didn't screenshot those. Oh, you wrote them down. I wrote them down because I thought you were playing bingo. Oh, I changed my mind. Oh, you did? Yeah. Why? I don't know. Because I, I, I can't do patience? multiple things at a time. Why? I just can't. Oh. I, I don't fucking know. I'm sorry. Or can I ever? Yeah, mm -hmm. but not very often. I'm sorry, baby. <sighs> Here, cheers me. So this wonderful Fucky Ducky Michael Bolton Friday. Right? Mm. Uh, sure. That was nice. Anyway, I hope you guys have had a great week. It's been a minute. But we are back for another week until next Friday. Um, but in the time that we were gone, I got a list. <coughs> and this isn't topics that I just come up with the top of my head. This is real life shit that happened. Um, and we're going to discuss. Uh, yeah. So... You like my chicken scratches? I was in a hurry. You're really gonna mention that I called you in the fucking backyard. Yes. We'll <laughs> That's the whole fucking thing. We'll get to that. Anyways, so <laughs> let me just ask, how was your day, Mrs. McStud? Um, it's uh, okay. I I I was kinda bitchy mm -hmm. for a while. That's not uncommon with Mrs. McStud. No, but I knew I recognized I wasn't being a bitch. Mm -hmm. Like and then after I went and picked up my food and shit. Listening to some music, I was fine. Well, knowing is half the battle. <clears throat> so. You know, and Miss McStud also lost two lighters this week, and I found them both. So, uh, I've lost more than that. I lost my other new one. So I bought... Uh, With that I, dinosaur thing on that moped thing. Mm -hmm. I fucking lost that. I've never... I haven't seen it. I don't even know what happened. It's probably in the grass. Hey, but I have a half a dollar. Uh, that's a whole mess, too. <laughs> Keep playing back. We about to see some snatch. Shit. Mm. Half a dollar. And her son had the other half. <laughs> and now, hang on. Let, let, that's let's, what happens at our house. Hang, let, let's, 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 uh. I'm going to need, where's that other money at? What other money? Of his. I don't get it back to him. I don't know where it's at. I don't have it. Oh, that does. Oh, I don't know. Let's see if this matches up. So we got this and we got this. Um. Mm-hmm. Kinda. I, I think some pieces are missing. So I text him, I'm like, what the hell? He goes, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. Yep. Oh, there we go. Yes, that we is. We were drinking together last night and had some tequila. Some, just some, just a little. I mean, we weren't bad. Okay. <laughs> um... <clears throat> Oh, you're going to sit on your cigarette. There, there, there's that lie for the day. Um, <laughs> we didn't do anything stupid or anything. There's another lie for the day. Um, yeah. <laughs> wow. But, uh, yeah, so you guys had a... Yeah, you know, we didn't get it 4th of July. If you guys had a safe 4th of July, no one blew their dick off. Um, we had a nice 4th of July. We got to go to yeah. her sister's house and they had a cookout. So we had grilled food, which is... Which is <laughs> delicious yeah and they have a nice big fucking yard and we can see fireworks going on the background and they bought a whole bunch of fucking nice fireworks too so it's pretty cool except she was getting eaten up like bugs that's because i'm sweet you are sweet he didn't get touched one time and he ain't sweet no nah, but see I, I like to uh i'm a bug I, I i feast on three main areas 
Uh huh. The one titty, two titty, and the crotch. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yes. That's, and, and maybe your neck. No. But I gotta be careful with the neck because she uh, <coughs> gets hickeys on accident. And we're not hickey couples. No. At all. Those are ugly. Um. So I, I barely gave her a little suckle on her neck one time. The next thing I know, she got a fucking little bruise on her neck. I'm like, what the fuck? I barely sucked on your neck. Like, that's a whole fucking mess. My skin's sensitive. Oh. So what you're saying is you're a sensitive ass bitch. I'm really not. No, no, she's not at all. I'm very insensitive. Yeah. <laughs> that ain't is no that shit. a word? Yeah. Oh, I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> I thought I... You didn't make that up. That's an actual word, baby. Mother of God. <laughs> wow. Uh, in other news, we got a compliment from one of my former teachers, which was amazing. Thank you, sir, if you're watching the show. That was a... Uh, I was uh, really impressed by that, and I didn't see that one coming. <laughs> but it's always good to get those comments. Yeah, it says uh, you can fuck something. Oh. I only remember the important words. See, fuck is in my vocabulary. It was focus, fuck off something. Yeah. Uh, I can't remember. Memory fails me, which is why I've been I've been putting notes in my phone. I'm about week. to look it up. Hold on a minute. And I thought. Mrs. McStuzz is going to be playing bingo on our Facebook Live. So I went and wrote them down. So I was going to screenshot it and send to her. Um, man, where should we start, baby? I don't even know. I had a, mo I had a lot of moments. So let's... It says, focus. Fuck off because you're stupid. That's right. You're spelled with a U mm -hmm. apostrophe. You're. R-E. You're. You're. Urination. Oof. What? Urination. Yes. That's peeing. Yeah. Ah. Urology. That's a study of the pee hole. That's a study of the... Yeah. I was going to say study of the penis. But they can still study vaginas too, I guess. Is it a penis study or is it just basic? Is it it's, no, provoked? it's urinary. Oh. It's urinary stuff. I wasn't sure if there was like a technicality there I was missing. Mm -hmm. um, Alright, little history here. So, for quite a while now, I've always been telling Mrs. McStud that she is the MILF of her son's friend group Ridiculous. and she's like what and she this. didn't even know what that meant so i had to tell her mom i'd like to fuck i was like you are the mom that the friends would totally tag and she's like whatever 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 so their friends were over and uh and we have a long drive now and it was just me and two boys two teenage boys and she had how did you come up on this well i can't remember I, I really can't remember what that conversation entailed mm -hmm. or how it even came up. I don't fucking know, but I just asked. Mm -hmm. And what did they say? They said, absolutely. <laughs> At first they hesitated. <coughs> and then, because I had the two quiet ones, mm -hmm. they hesitated. Mm -hmm. And then they go, you need to ask our other friend. He'll tell you the truth. I said, oh, all right, he's coming over tomorrow, I'll ask. But finally they go, yeah, yeah, you are. They're kind of quiet. And yeah. so I asked the other friend that's one. And uh, <clears throat> he goes, yeah, I'd be the first two and the last. <laughs> <laughs> so so once again, McStub was right because I'm always right. And you had to disagree and you found out the hard way. So she's like, this is fucking ridiculous. It is kind of ridiculous. It's funny, but it's true. I mean, <laughs> I mean, shit, at that age and I saw you, I do that at this stage right now. I look <laughs> at you and I'm like, damn, <sighs> you're my MILF. Oof. Yeah, what? <laughs> <clears throat> you know, when your kids have kids, you're going to be my GILF. Oof. What? We, I don't want to talk about being a grandma. No, it's not, but I'm just saying at some point, you're going to be my GILF. Grandma, I like to fuck. Hey. What? Where's my hair dye? It's in this box right here. Okay, we're going to dye my hair. When? Tonight? Or tomorrow? Or whenever you want? I don't know. You don't know? I'll get back with you on that. You no, know, funny. Just depends on how much I want to drink. Okay. Well, I, I was actually looking for my facial hair trimmers. If you guys don't notice, I got rid of that fucking old man shit that I've been growing since before No Shave November. Uh, my facial hair grows slowly. But then I found your hair dye in there in that box. That's like, funny you just happened to ask that. But I just happened to find it. I still never found my razor arm yeah so i spent like 88 cents on those cheap ones at walmart yeah so i could use that just like a shave my fucking face <clears throat> it's a whole mess um 
Uh, hold on. Do you have change? Or do you just have 20s? I have 20s. Okay. Yes. Um, where, where, where should we go next, baby? Uh, I don't know. I got one. <laughs> so, y'all, I'm, I'm sure you have seen the Swiffer Wetback. I think it's a Swiffer Wetback commercial, right? Um, and th th this has happened before. I just, I, I, I don't think we discussed it on video, but every time we talked about, hey, we got these hardwood floors and a Swiffer wet, wet vac would be nice. And she goes, baby, we need to get one of those wet jacks. And I'm like, you know, I would love a wet jack right about now. Um, you are absolutely right. Let's go ahead and take care of that wet jack. Um, I'll have at it, baby. Fuck. <laughs> and she says it multiple, like, do we need, is that one of those wet jacks? <laughs> Not yet, but it's gonna be. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, so she totally calls the Swiffer wet back a wet jack. Um, I meant to say wet jet or wet jack. I don't fucking know. Maybe it's wet jet. Swiffer wet jet. I don't, but a Swiffer wet jack sounds better to me, so it just comes out cleaner. Yeah, I don't know. That's not a vac. Because it doesn't, I, it doesn't suction anything, so it has to be the wet no. jet. See, it it, it, it uh, flows a lot better on my off my tongue. At least I said wet vac and not wet jack. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck, man? Wet jack sounds better than wet jet. I could go for a wet jack. You want to hook I, it up, baby? No. Oh, damn. I want to sleep. <laughs> Miss McStubb is up late. We'll get to that, too, here in a bit. Um, so that's another one on the list. <clears throat> Next one on the list. So, we had to drive to Greenfield. You need to come sit over here and do that. No, no. I just said I'm not doing that. I'm going to bed. I know. I'm just saying, though. If you're going to do I... it, don't waste the movement. I'm good. You're Gucci? Yep. <laughs> so, so, it's really hot. Was that Sunday? Mm-mm. Monday? Monday. Monday. It was really hot out, and we took a... The roommate's car because we were a little low on gas in ours and he's got a black car and it was just hot and the air it wasn't it's a small car and she has to drive it because my big ass i'm just too big for this motherfucking car um so it's warm in there so i'm looking at the ac controls i'm like well she had it on her feet i'm like fuck it we don't need it on our feet we need it on our face so yeah. i switched it to that god damn why are you telling me my hair look like this i think your hair looks good baby what, what the fuck <laughs> she's always so anal about her hair, man. I think it looks good all the time, and she looks at it like, no. So she has to ask me in the fucking car, is my hair okay? So I look at it, I'm like, to me, yes. To you, you're going to yell at me if I say yes. So she's like, all right, I'll redo it. But anyways, so I'm looking at that. She's got the air Ow. button pushed. You okay? Yeah, my back hurts. Sorry about that. That ain't from you. It's probably from me. Look at this bruise. Oh, my God, yes. I got, I got... <laughs> And I got some more wounds too. Um, you haven't seen this. Huh? Hold on, that ain't that leg. Just a second. It's the other leg. You can't remember what leg the bruise is on? No, I can't remember what I did. Oh my god. Where? Oh, right there. Oh. Oh. Damn, baby. She is out of control. Speaking of controls, we're talking about the air conditioning controls. So there's that. One circulation button, you know, in the wintertime, when you're trying to get your car warm, it recirculates the warm air from inside. Um, she was using that in the middle of summer. I'm like, what the <coughs> fuck? It's just recirculating all the hot air that's in here. <laughs> I'm not asking Melina about that when it gets here. Why? Because I don't think you're right about it. I am absolutely right about it. I don't think so. Yeah. Because it makes no sense in my head. Why don't you Google it? I'm not going to Google. I'm going to ask him. Okay. He knows everything so, about cars. So here's the thing. We turn that button off and it starts working a lot better. And she's like, I guess I've been doing. It just blew out faster. It, uh, no. She's like, I guess I've been doing that wrong for 34 years. Absolutely. <laughs> so there's that. Let's see what else do we got here? I've also realized. I don't know why I never thought of this before, but Mrs. McStud has a drunk pose. And I actually have some pictures I'm going to try to place right here. If I can't get them on there, I'm trying to put the pictures on the video. 
So that's why I paused. Um, but she has this pose when she's drunk where she sticks her tongue out and goes, <laughs> like, uh, here's Johnny. What the fuck? I don't know what the fuck you're doing. Here but, I am. I'm yeah. the life of the motherfucking So party. I got several pictures. Actually, Molina. <laughs> I got several pictures of her with all of us doing this, which is fucking hilarious. It's cute, too. Like, you stick that tongue out. It's sexy as well. It really is the way you do so it. So why are we putting this on the video then? No, it's the way you do it and that smile of yours, which is already amazing anyway. You're like, <laughs> like, damn, come here, baby. I'll give you something to do with that tongue. <laughs> FFS. What? That's out of control. Uh, you're out of control. <clears throat> um, so there's that. <sighs> okay. So the other night her and our buddy were out walking around and it's, it's late and he was uh feeling pretty good needless to say awesome tequila and so was she, so was she so i just making sure they're okay because well because i was the sober one drunk sober sober one um and i'm walking it's dark i'm looking for them and i trip over some brush on the fucking sidewalk, bust my fucking knee, and I hardly walk for a day. That's how I got this nice road rash gab. My elbow hurts. He's got the worst bruise ever on, my on hip. The, his upper thigh. Yeah, it doesn't hurt. It really hurt. I didn't even know it was there until I took a bath. <coughs> but it looks nasty. Um, so I fell down looking for these drunk hooligans. <coughs> um, so that was one night. And then on another I night. I don't know what I did. She got bruises. Looks like she always gets them on her arm, or it looks like I was like, like I'm an abusive husband or some shit. You wouldn't abuse me if anybody knows me. They know you ain't gonna abuse me because I would beat the fuck out of you. Well, I don't put my hands on women anyway. I but, know, but still, uh, at the end of the day, I'd kill you. Oh, I know you would. And I wouldn't need nobody else yeah. to do it for me. What's that movie that uh, Jennifer Lopez where her she got <laughs> beat by her husband and finally she starts training and whoops I don't his ass? Need to and, but she was whooping his ass and killing him at the end. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that'd be Mr. McStud. She'd be whooping my ass and I'd be dead by the end of the night. Yep. Uh, Pretty so much. That's, that's why we, we don't do that. Like already knows this shit. So, at least he knows something. So, we don't know a whole lot. So just make fun of me. So our... Uh, <laughs> uh, this is true. <laughs> our friend likes tequila. <clears throat> and I like tequila too. So he wanted to go drink for a drink with me. Like, Miss McStud's like, I'm going to be cool tonight. Tonight's your night. I, I was cool. Yeah, no, but she wanted, you wanted. Yeah. Hold up. That's part of this story, too. Like, these both go hand in hand. So, <laughs> I'm like, okay. Uh, whatever did the tequila <laughs> fucked me up. I ended up throwing up twice. Um, so, I end up drunk in the bed. And I wake up, and these motherfuckers. <laughs> like, it's late. It's like 5 in the morning. Everyone's asleep and shit, but. Fuck. I'm like they're just I look out and they have this big goofy drunk grin. I'm like, hold the fuck up. Y'all get me drunk and then I wake up and you guys are drunk. I I, I got drunk. I was responsible. Mm -hmm. Like you were supposed to be out for the night. Mm -hmm. I had the roommate put down for the night. Mm -hmm. And after that, it's me time. Like it's yeah. me. I go. Yeah. yeah. It's my turn. So I end up waking up like five in the morning. You should have stay asleep. I couldn't <clears throat> sleep anymore. But anyways, it was funny. So I, it, she, and and so, the next day after that tequila night, um, we we're sitting there talking. About, I was like, "That was rough, man. I can't do that like I used to." And she goes, "Well, you can't. You just can't pound it like he can." I'm like, "I forgot about." That. I'm like, "Wait a minute." And she goes, "Oh my god, that didn't sound right." I was like, "No, it didn't." Like, <laughs> do I need to practice? <laughs> uh, practice things. Perfect. Fuck, I mean, it, <laughs> you gonna sit here and tell me another dude can pound it better than me. Uh, that, that's a whole motherfucking mess. Um, yeah. Just remember, practice makes perfect. Yes, well, let's practice. Just Not on, with just, me. Just on another night. I ain't gonna practice with no one else. <laughs> Make a hole in the bed. Fuck that. <laughs> Fuck that. That's no fun. <laughs> Shit. You just gotta pour some. What would work? Warm lube? Like if you warm up some lube and like pour it in that hole, then it would feel like a twat that's wet? I don't think this material would feel anything like a twat. 
Um, and there's springs in the bitch. All right, but I'll buy you a flashlight. I'm, I'm cool. I done had one of those. I know. You said it was hard to clean. That's the worst part of it. It's a clean up. That um, ain't my motherfucking problem. Yeah, I already know. I already know. <coughs> um, so then, let's see. Got all that. Got that. Got that. Got that. And, and the last one. So, her and her buddy are feeling pretty good again, and they decide they want to go for a walk. This wasn't my idea this time. And I'm like, okay, because he got to, you know. He, he got to sober up to go home. He drives home. Yeah, so we let, him, we let him eat, and he gets, you know, a few hours to chill the fuck out. And uh, so, she's texting me, like, all that, and I'm like, okay, you guys cool. He's like, well, if I need anything, I'll call. Boy, do I get a call. And all I hear is ruckus in the background. Can you come back here and help? I'm like, what the fuck? So I run through the backyard. This motherfucker is on the ground. She's like almost on the ground laughing. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Because I didn't know what to do. <laughs> and then he ends in face plants beside his old shed out back because he moved away, which was, uh, oh, not that neighbor, the other neighbor. Um, yeah, it was a, a fun, good time. And I decided to plop in the grass with him. And then I changed on the fucking front porch. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. My she, pants my pants were over the fucking thing. She's on the front porch <laughs> the with some day. pajama pants. She's like, hold on. Down to her underwear. <laughs> Put changing pants on the porch. <laughs> I'm sorry. Wait. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's why I can't take Miss Nickstead anywhere, but I love her crazy ass, and she loves my crazy ass, <laughs> which is, uh, it works out pretty fucking amazing, really, for the most part. But we compliment each other really well. Yeah. Like, we both, uh, try to do the things the others can't. Or, well, you can do everything. I just try to do things I can. Oh, I was thinking, since we're going to be in Anderson, uh -huh. I bet Lowe's, Menards, Home Depot... Or someplace over there has a window air conditioner. Okay. Yeah, I bet you're right. I didn't say that because I'd forget it later. Mm -hmm. Sorry to interrupt. You know, window air conditioner. We're gonna we're gonna be over there. Like, what were we over here to get? <laughs> I told you. So now it's on you, not me. Yeah, this happens all the time. She's like, "Well, I told you." I was like, "Well, fuck." Sometimes my memory's about as good as yours, which sucks a bag of dicks. What? I remember numbers like a mofo. You remember certain things and numbers. Hold on. I just seen. Melina's number one time and I can rattle it off right now. Jesus Christ. Well, don't rattle it off on video. I'm not, yeah, but I just programmed it in the roommate's phone and I know it. Wow, that's pretty impressive. Not me, it takes me a minute. And I did. I had only seen it the one time when I put it in my phone. Wow. And then then. <clears throat> and I know it. Wow. That's pretty good, baby. Cheers. Just in case I ever get arrested. <laughs> it, it, here's the uh, thing. You know, back in the day you get arrested... You remember your home phone number mm -hmm. or certain phone numbers. <clears throat> now everyone just puts them in their contacts and they call them. They don't have to dial the motherfucker anymore. So I can't imagine, you know, like, man, can I make a phone call? And you're like, what the fuck? At least I know your number and you know mine. Yeah. Um, but we don't get arrested. Um, but if, you never know with me. <laughs> I like to fight. <laughs> Sometimes. This is true. This is true. Um, Sometimes I'm just angry and I need to fucking just well into some fucking some cut that I can't fucking say in. Why don't you take your anger out on me sexually? That what do you want me to do? Fuck punch you in the face while your dick's at me? I mean I said my fist needs to go in somebody's know. fucking face. I don't know. Grab my shoulders. Just be rough. No. I punch you. <laughs> Damn. I punch your chest. Oh god. That's a whole fucking mess. <laughs> 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 mm. So her son's been working at McDonald's. About a month now? Mm-hmm. And he finally just got his two paychecks today. <clears throat> finally. After a fucking month and a whole mess of bullshit. And two trips for me to go to McDonald's because a goddamn motherfucker named Buster is a cock. Um, until Mr. McStud calls and he changes his tone. He straight changed his tone. And by the end of the conversation, he was super nice. Mm -hmm. And I thanked him. I said, thank you for protecting his money or whatever, mm -hmm. you know. I appreciate that. Mm -hmm. Just not giving it to some random stranger. However, 
he gave your motherfucking name to that bitch to answer the motherfucking phone. Yes. He did. And uh that's because she told me I was like, Well, my fuck? son's been sick, so he hasn't been able to work, sadly. Uh, I don't know what what's wrong with him. He's going to the doctor in the morning. Yeah. Um <clears throat> but he's been throwing up once or twice every day, mm -hmm. really, for like four days. He had a bad headache today, too. Yeah. Uh. Um, <clears throat> so, I'm taking him to the doctor. He has to have a doctor's note to get back to work or whatever, but he couldn't go get his check because he had to call in today because he threw up this morning. Mm -hmm. He works at McDonald's. McDonald's don't want you there if you puke him. Right. And if they do, then they're raggedy bitches. <laughs> and he's still ain't coming in. Yeah. This is true. Uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure I told him that too. What? Because that. <laughs> the fuck? Because that uh, bitch that I talked to on the phone. That bitch I talked to on the phone today, uh, after he threw up the other night at work and I had to go pick him up early, he fucking, that bitch wanted him to fucking stay at work. Really? He done threw up at work in front of you and you want him to fucking finish his shit. Fuck you. He had one hour. He had one hour left. He's motherfucking sick. I'll beat that bitch's ass too. That's that rude one mm -hmm. going through the drive-thru. I don't like that bitch. And I, I haven't even ever talked to her except today on the phone. But she knows who I am. I guarantee that better fucking shit. Oh, boy. She goes, I, I expected your call. Bitch, I bet you did. <clears throat> Mrs. McStud at her motherfucking finest. I love it. Hmm. See, I'm, I'm too nice. He is. Hmm. And it pisses me off sometimes. For hmm. real. Because this is what happens. Like, he's too nice. And I need him to make a phone call. Because I'm at work. You know? He's at home. Make this phone call for me. And then he texts me some crazy bullshit. I said, did you tell him that that's a crock of shit? No. Do it. Fucking do it. Just say it. Call them out on their fucking stupid bullshit. Never mind. I'll do it. And that's what I spend my lunch break doing. It's making stupid ass phone calls. Because he don't know how to do that. He don't know how to fucking be a dick. I just want you to be a dick for a half a day. Like, just well, let him fucking have it, please. Can you tell them they can fall off a fucking cliff and die? Break their motherfucking neck? I mean, can you say anything? Not anything? You know, you would have been proud of me. I said this in front of people in line at Speedway today. So I got this call from another city in Indiana. It's kind of close by. I can't remember what it was. I was like, what the fuck's that? So I answered it. You know, maybe it was one of the kids' friends yeah. or whatnot. Because <coughs> it was around that area, I think, where one of the kids' friends might, you know, live, might have a number around there. So I'm like, hello. Waiting. And finally get on. This guy wants to talk to me about fucking insurance. He's like, hi, this is Mike. So, <laughs> so people know I'm like trying on phone. And I said, fuck you, Mike. And I fucking hung the phone up on him. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, God, you would have been so proud of me if you would have been here today. I would have. <laughs> but why can't you do that when I need you to do that? Like, if somebody's uh, doing bullshit, like, say the plumbers, for an example. That's a good example. Like, who's that first plumber I had out here? And uh, I told you. Mr. Plumber. I said, that's a crock of fucking shit. Mm-hmm. Well, they went... They... And this is what you do. You Instead of you saying... That's a crock of fucking shit or calling them out on their bullshit. You fucking just text me. She can deal with it. Tell them. Tell them to their motherfucking face. That's a crock of shit. You but what if me? I was wrong? I don't know much about plumbing. It's a crock of fucking shit. It was common sense. What the fuck do I know? I fucking just use the toilet and flush it. Well, the funny thing is they went through the wrong fucking uh, drain pipe to uh, snake our main line. Didn't think about it, but... <laughs> Even your dad thought it would be a good spot to go into, though. You know what I mean? Which is why I didn't really question it too much. Well, I did. Yeah. And then I had to get motherfucking new plumbers out here. Mm-hmm. That was a fun adventure, wasn't it? Until I told him. I was like, 
He called me and told me some line of bullshit. Like, you know what? They're feeding you a line of fucking bullshit. Did you tell them to suck a dick? I mean, anything. Anything. Did you even say have a fucking nice day? I mean, god damn. That pissed me off. So then I had to make fucking phone calls. And that pissed me off even more. So I called him. I'm like, hey. uh, And I tell. So I had Rotor Rear come out. And I tell the motherfucker on the phone. This bitch. I said. I had Mr. Plumber come out here. And he blowed me a full crock of shit. And. That's not flying. Like I don't. That doesn't make any sense in my head. Mm -hmm. It's common sense. Mm -hmm. She goes, oh, we can do this. Please schedule that. And I need it done ASAP. <laughs> oh, fuck. I done told her. I said, that's a crock of shit. <laughs> she goes, okay. <laughs> I, no, I'm not being literal. Li literally. Literal? Liter literal. L literal? Literal. Mm -hmm. I'm being for real. Uh, literal is for real. You literally mean that. I didn't say it that way. That's not what you meant to say. Oh, fuck. Well, you know, you, you were... I, I had a proud moment earlier when you brought up insensitive and you found out it was a word. My God! That amazed me. That is pretty amazing. Usually, when she thinks she has a word, I'm like, no, baby, that's not a word. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Listen to that laugh. That's that's her that's her naughty laugh. <laughs> that's her evil laugh. Actually, it's called the evil laugh. It can be evil or naughty. It's not naughty. It can be sometimes. Because I'm not feeling it. No, but I mean, it's I need a, to go to bed. I mean, like sometimes it is. You're like, yeah. <laughs> like oh shit. <laughs> uh, yeah, this mixed up was up really late last night, and I tried to stay up, but I'm trying to switch my sleep schedule over so I can go to bed with her at night. Because I've been staying up to help take care of our roommate. And it's, I'm tired and it's fucking with me and I'm, I'm having a hard time sleeping during this transition even when I do get to sleep. Like, how many days have I just, like, slept for a couple hours this week? Um, I don't know. A couple days, two or three yeah. days? And then I'm just, Sorry, I'm, I'm texting Chastity. Oh, you're fine. And I'm just awake. I'm like, what the fuck? So, it was, I was close again, uh, staying up all night and I ended up falling asleep and then she was late to work again. And I felt horrible. I tried my heart. Holy shit. My God, I forgot I had to work. Oh, fuck. I forgot about that, too. That's not what happened today. Okay. I'm just going to take comps on and, and I'll work tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> if I don't drink tequila. Uh, well, damn. Hey, more might be funner on tequila. <laughs> fuck. I want to see some crazy shit. See, Miss McStone on some tequila. Oh, that's okay. it's, it's it, is, it is comical. <coughs> um, I'd like to take you to a hotel room with some tequila. Why? Because it makes your clothes fall off. Well, I, I can get naked I, I, without but, that. But I know that. I, I, no, no, I know that. But I bet you'd be like. We don't do that. You'd be a serial rapist <laughs> on me with some tequila. Maybe. <laughs> you know what I mean. Oh, I sure did lay with Melina in the backyard. Flop myself right on the ground. Yes, yes, she did. And this mixed up doesn't get on the ground for anything. That was a quite a comical moment as well. I could have slept there. Oh, Lord Jesus. I could have slept there all night. I was fucking wore out. You probably, I was done. You probably should have slept. <laughs> you probably <laughs> felt better today. I probably would have. <laughs> I'll come out there when the like, just leave me out here. Uh, just check on me every me, so often. Make sure animals ain't eating me. <laughs> bring me a blanket. Bring me a couple blankets. Give me one to lay on and one to cover up with. <laughs> she gonna wake up mosquito bites all over her fucking face. <laughs> Fuck. I might have been in a lot better shape today. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I, this is horrible, but I slept, but only for a few hours. And so, when I got to work, I mean, I drove drunk this morning. I was still drunk, for real. Oh, fuck. And I didn't realize it. No oh, fuck. And then, I come out for lunch, and my fucking front tires is all the fucking big. <laughs> That's it. Oh. Because <laughs> I was still in the I done pulled 
slow. <laughs> they were fully on the fucking pavement. Fuck, baby. <laughs> This is why Mrs. McStud, uh, is I Miss said, Tequila. Fuck. I just drove 45 fucking minutes. Like that. Jesus Christ. You are fucking grounded. Hey, in my defense, mm -hmm. <coughs> I went with the girls. Mm -hmm. Had like one and a half, one and three fourths mm -hmm. of a drink. Mm -hmm. It had like five different alcohols in it. I can't remember all of them, but mm -hmm. I do remember I had vodka. Mm -hmm. um, so Tito's vodka. Then I came home and I had some tequila, some beer, some gin and juice. Took a shot of Malibu. <laughs> this was all on a Thursday. But she had a good night with the girls and she had a good night in general. Yeah. Which I was happy for because she's uh, actually got people to hang out with now. It's been a minute since she had any, like, anyone. But I'm so <laughs> I can't go like I used to. <laughs> I'd be like, hey, what we go up? I got to work. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad you get to get out because like the last several months have been like cabin fever mm -hmm. in the house, and it's like fuck, man, just to get out and like get away, like without just going to the store or the gas <clears throat> station. Yeah, is you know nice. So I was happy that you got to do that. And just kind of blow off some steam. You know what I mean? Man, we were a mess. Yeah. I swear, you would have been embarrassed. <laughs> they seed us. First off, they seed us mm -hmm. with no motherfucking silverware. Oh. You, you know my loud mouth. Mm -hmm. We had this ditzy ass bitch. It's 22. Because I even looked at her and I was like, are you even old enough to serve me? God. She's like, I'm 22. I said, this was before any drinks. And because that's the one that fucked my friend's husband. Like, yeah. back in the day. There's that. So, I, I was a motherfucking smart ass. <laughs> and then we were sitting there. <clears throat> she got uh, my friend, the one that her husband fucked this chick. Mm -hmm. She got a uh, boneless wings. Mm -hmm. No fucking silverware. I said, hey. And the waiter comes over, waitress. <laughs> she goes, yeah. I said, could she have some silverware? Like, I'm pretty sure you don't serve finger like, foods here. No. <laughs> she needs silverware. We need a napkin. I mean, goddamn. I'm glad I didn't spill nothing. They don't know me. I fucking make a mess with everything. Anything. I can make a mess with fucking gummy bears. Okay, <laughs> like <laughs> you got, I gotta have napkins. <laughs> yep, that's how I got uh, broken into Miss McStud at a restaurant. And I was like, "Holy shit, she don't take no shit." And like you were the whole time. It, that time at Show Me's when they had set our beers up there. Oh my god! Saw it. So these bitches, I go to Show Me's. I go to Hooters. I don't care. You know, I got everything that they fucking have. And guess what? He going home with me. I don't care to go. It's fine. They got amazing food. Mm -hmm. But them bitches are dumb. Like, that's why they work there. Because that's the only place they can work. They're not smart enough to work anywhere else. <laughs> it's true. So, we ordered our beers. We probably told this story before. Mm -hmm. But we ordered our beers. Is that Lena? What time is it? 10.15? I don't think so. I think that was a motorcycle. We order our beers and the bitch fucking put them on the counter. And I could see just like the ice fucking just melting off of them. Yeah, they had frozen mugs. So you get your beer, it's supposed to be a frozen mug. That's what I wanted. Yeah. And we were watching UFC fights. Yes. <clears throat> so I see my beers sitting up there. Our beers. And we're waiting. And then, yeah, we're just sitting there fucking waiting. And then this ditzy ass bitch comes take my motherfucking order. I'm like, hey, can you get my beers first? Like they're, and they're, I said that. They're up there, I mean, like, for real. The, the mugs are fucking melted now. And she's like, oh my god, yeah. Well, I'm like, this crazy. I was like, hey, I like this woman. I already did like this woman, but damn. Uh, it's one of the many millions of reasons I love her. And he looks at me and he's like, 
And I bitch went to get our fucking beer and then I'll order. <laughs> she's I'm like, thirsty. She's like, I got the goddamn beers, didn't I? I was like, yes, she did, baby. <laughs> I didn't know what else to say. <laughs> like, I could see the bitch sit sitting up there like Melby. Like, yeah. can you give me that? And then I can have enough saliva to tell you what the fuck I want to eat. And well, the fucked up thing is they sat, up, they sat up there for a good 10 minutes. They did. Um, it wasn't even frozen when no. we got the cups or anything. No. Like, it wasn't just like they're up there. No, there was a good 10 minutes. Oh, no, yeah. Like, like, we should have enjoyed the condensation on our table from our fucking frozen mugs of beer. That shit pissed me <clears> off. Yeah. That was our first date. <laughs> no, that wasn't our first date. That was our second or third. Because our first date, we went to that goddamn oh, Straw yes. Dogs movie. Yes. <clears throat> which I would have rather right. had a hand job in a movie theater than watch that movie. Hey, I mean. We could have made that happen. I think well, we. Uh huh? What? It was alright. It was slow. Yeah, but I mean, it was kind of funny. In parts. And but the the whole preview made it seem like it was a crazy lot of. Well, we didn't want to go to that though. We no. went to see something else that wasn't there, right? Yeah, I forget what it was, but we ended up watching that. It's like, hey, I see the preview looked pretty good, so let's try that. And like, I I just want to spend time with her. You know what I mean? I don't care what the fuck we watched really. Yeah. And I know what we're gonna do in a movie theater, but uh, we didn't do. I nothing. was good. Yeah, you were good. I was good in the movie theater. I was like, do I need to cut a hole in the bottom of this bucket of popcorn? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe the best popcorn's at the bottom. You get all two inches of McStud. Two inches? Yeah. <laughs> what? FFS. FFS. I love you. It's not two inches. I, I'm not good with inches and shit, so I ain't going to try to measure. All right, two and three quarters. Ah! What the fuck is that? That's enough to stick the tip in. Is that that big? That is not two and a half. Two and three quarters is about like that. Soft. No, that's hard, baby. <laughs> I mean, like, <laughs> I can measure. I'm like, yeah, you want this stub? How do I get my nails done tomorrow? Oh, shit, Miss McSud's excited about that. Mmm, about time. Ratchet ass nails. <laughs> I'm done with this. Oh, shit, you finished it. I was just about to ask because we're 42 minutes oh. out. Mm -hmm. But hey, Miss McStug got a new hairbrush today because she left hers at her cousin's when she got her hair done. How oh, time to never go over there. <laughs> I'm busy. So I was like, fuck it, I just got you a new hairbrush. People be pulling me every fucking multiple, multi motherfucking directions and shit. Yep. And I don't even know if I'm coming or going. Well, I know when I come. Well, I can make sure. I know. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> I feel that shit. Yes, you do. Mm. But going, I don't. I don't know. When her thighs are like a vice grip on my fucking head, I'm crazy. Hey, my own problem. Yeah, I, I like that problem. That's a problem I enjoy. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm when you flip me over on the, the dresser okay. with your leg lock. <laughs> <laughs> That's a true story too. Anyways, <laughs> <laughs> thanks for watching, my fuckers. We'll catch you bitches tomorrow for. Hey. Uh, what? Oh. Y'all crazy. Y'all crazy. Baby, let's end it with the, the pose. Okay. All right, you ready? Yep. One, two, three. <laughs> Deuces, bitches. <laughs>